Hello. How is everyone doing today? Hope everyone is having a good day, because for now I'm thinking of getting back to, to Mario 64 and hopefully it's not going to be as painful as last time. <laughs> oh, 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 the oh, LBO Jig! Okay. That one trick was pretty rough. After that, like, I was on a good rhythm. Let me open a uh, live split here. I'm gonna continue to try to learn this speed run <laughs> as a speed run. Hopefully it works all right. Let's go back to seeing what this guy was doing. Oh, I didn't do this. I did cannonless. Here we go! <laughs> yes, I'm doing this now. Okay, it doesn't- it doesn't seem too difficult. Let's see if I can replicate it just off of sheer ability. <laughs> yeah. Mario? 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 Okay. Why can't I jump? I just need the second height jump. It's so far! There is no way! There's just no way. Yes! Okay, 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 okay. Triple jump. Triple triple jump it is. I'm pressing the wrong button. I don't know why I'm doing that. I'm pressing the punch button. I'm just gonna wing it. Nope, don't wing it. <laughs> Bad idea. Okay. Stop diving! <laughs> Stop doing that, Rob. I feel like I'm gonna get this one. Rough. That's a rough. I think I'm not hitting it at the tip of my jump. I think that that's my problem right now. It seems to be really precise. Which I guess everyone told me it would be. <laughs> but no. Said Rods. I have to try all the tricks. I have to do it. Come on! The setup isn't really that hard for hitting the... I guess maybe it, it is hard. I'm just not... I'm gonna try my own setup. Rod setup. Rod setup. No, it looked really good! It looked really good! <laughs> You're kidding me. It looked so nice, and high, and perfect, but I want to do it. That's the fun part. <laughs> it's these tricks. I love these tricks. I'm gonna do it. I feel like it would be better to do it from this side. If I can... If I can figure it out. Oh! Oh! One of the most satisfying Mario sounds is in Galaxy, when he lands on a planet after a shooting star. Oh! Oh! Here we go! Took me four hours to do this. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, who needs owls? I can take 30 attempts in my speedrun to get that. <laughs> you recovered three power stars, now you can open your... What's next? Okay, he goes back in again. Oh, I know what this one is. Okay. okay. Oh, he does a he does the breakdance kick. The breakdance kick is. I never figured out how to do that one. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Maybe I won't. And then you just go. Whoa. And then you just go. Whoa. How do I do this? Ha! Oh. Come on, Mario. Come on, Mario. Yes! I don't even know what, they, what you call this. I guess that's it for that one. Two minutes. Nice. Yeah, I guess the nice part of platformer speed is that most of the tricks become easier as you... Yeah. No, for sure. And that's... 
generally my favorite type of speedrun to watch. And in general, I love games like platformers where it's a lot of you just being good at the game, even for more normal things, because it has a high skill ceiling. I love games with high skill ceiling that are platformers. And I'm not very good at them, but I genuinely enjoy them. That's it for upstairs. Here, uh, I'll play it again, because this trick. I watched a 16-star Mario speedrun a long time ago, and I remember seeing this. I mean, even the, the guy struggles with it. And I know that you have to do that bomb trick in uh, Bob-omb's Battlefield too. So maybe I should train doing it at Bob-omb's? Because I have, I have not even a concept of how this is done. Hey, what is up, YouTube? And today I'm going to show you how to do- 2014, my boy. Oh, 2014 intro. That's what I'm talking about. Tutorials, just how to do bomb clip. Um, this is not that hard of a trick once you know how to do it. But yeah, I'm going to teach you how to do it. And that's pretty much how you do it. Thank you. That was very informative. And you want to jump and double jump. Okay. Right on the second double jump, like right right as you press A, which you can test this out by just doing a kick. If you do a kick like this, okay. Uh, you should be doing a kick that looks exactly like this. Just try okay. pressing A and B at the same time. I need to inflate the size of my foot. Bit. Got just it. Your hand on it. Or just actually slam my hand down and just make sure. Yes. The, like right side of my thumb. I, I understood the kick concept. A little bit before that. So just see if you can do this. <laughs> I can uh, do it, sir. Do it right I can now, do it. It won't it won't be like yo yo yo. It'll be like wahoo wahoo. Yeah, it's gonna be a wahoo, not yo yo. Okay, okay. I and um basically on the second jump you wanna press it just like that. We're on the yes. Jump. This man questions your ability to inflate your limbs in most contexts. This is a rational concern. I guess so. I guess maybe he's a doctor. He understands the difficulty of doing said things in real life. You know, when you're experimenting on like people in the hospital because you're a student or whatever, and you're just like, you know, time to inflate a patient. You flip down. And you want to press B. Now it's Click not down and be press B. Down, so don't think that. It's sometimes going to be a little bit right, sometimes a little left. You really have to. So see not where your complete ball down. Is. So right here, I'm going to have to flip like down right. Like. So what you you're saying is in the direction of the bomb. So right there. So I should have pressed B right. <laughs> I don't think I that it was right there. But I don't know. I don't. This is kind yeah. of a questionable tutorial. <laughs> a couple things you want to watch out for. Um, I kind of messed up that. I could have easily had that, but... Oh, of course. Line, of course, you sir. Read it. What's your name? Do the bomb? Let me see if I can actually get it. Kristen. I can never of course. I want to show it off. You could have totally had that, but uh, you didn't. You didn't want to. There we go. Got it. Nice. Uh, but this is... I didn't know you could move the camera while you're looking at a sign. Anyway, that's... Um, Are you, what <laughs> he's like, reading uh, He's reading that sign with the bob <laughs> Also, okay, this is a tangent, but this shows off one of my favorite things they did in Mario 64, which is for the bombs and a lot of just circular things. They use a 2D sprite, but it, much like the trees, it turns with you. And it, unlike the trees, it's a very convincing effect. The trees look horrible, but the ball bombs, because they're completely round, it looks super nice and crisp, especially in comparison to the actual polygonal graphics of the game. Like there's a lot fewer edges than you would have expected. It was a really smart way of doing it. Um, what I'll look like, and uh, the bomb will just stay there. But once you finish the sign, well, first of all, the sign takes time, but the bomb will blow up. Why were you doing the sign? Okay, Did he, he do that on purpose? Change. Basically, you want the angle to be, through. let's see, this way, except with Mario turn this way. So this. <laughs> so the opposite of what you said, which is also perpendicular to the... So basically like a perfect perfect angle with it you know a perpendicular uh, like angle like this different from like is there a perfect like angle this. all right i'm actually gonna try that um what they call a bomb clip see he told me to face down but it's clearly towards the bomb now i have the knowledge of trying to face downwards or towards the camera and it's completely useless <laughs> grab Oh! I don't think I've ever hit the chain chomp with the bomb in normal play. Do the Goombas respawn? 
Why don't the Goombas respawn? Why does the bomb respawn and the Goombas not? Maybe they use, I wonder if for in the programming they use the coins that the Goombas hold. So once that coin is taken, they don't respawn, but because bombs don't have coins attached to them, they respawn. Oh! I somehow need to gain more speed from that. I guess it needs to be the speed of the bomb is maintained. No. It was just normal. It was just a normal bomb. I'm so good at getting these bombs, I don't break the game. Okay, okay. Oh, do I need to let go? Is that... Okay, back to the video. Does he let go? He didn't tell me about letting go. And this... Drogi! I'm just gonna check Drogi's channel. Drogi really comes through. Tap down and go towards the gate, holding the... Yeah, the guy never mentioned you left it on neutral. Once you're close enough to the gate, press B to throw the bomb away, and it will push you back. That was incredibly helpful. <laughs> Immediately, I was in the right position there. Drogi, Drogi, coming in with an incredible tutorial. I mean, I mean, Drogi just came in and saved our day. Go check out Drogi. Drogi is cool. He's so cool. Hey, go. Hey, hey! How did they do it? How did... Did they rethrow? Is that... Is that what occurs in this reality? So it's gonna be... Grab. Oh, he does it off the first jump. So he dives. Okay, so jump, jump, dive, jump, ground pound. How do they make it so it doesn't blow up? Is that why they keep jumping? Maybe that's the deal. You have to keep jumping. So that it doesn't blow up. Or maybe the bigger the bomb is, the better it is. So I wonder if it's a collision issue. I thought it maybe was like the momentum of the bomb, but it might be a collision issue. So like the bigger you get the bomb, the better it works. But that's incredibly precise. Yeah, 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 look at that. Oh, oh. Ah! Maybe it's if you stop. Maybe I should just not <laughs> do this one. I feel like this is a, a cut above of any of the previous tricks I was doing. Other than LBLJ. <laughs> I was in! No, I, I got BL, LBLJ. I got LBLJ. Are you saying that then I should be able to get anything else? If only I had your confidence. I think LBLJ taught me a very, very important <laughs> lesson. I was in! He drops it. Do I have to re-grab? Is that the thing? I have to re-grab? Okay, I'm not gonna do this trick. <laughs> um, I'll do the other two stars. I saw that not everyone. <laughs> okay. Will people die? Hey, there we go. One, two. <laughs> Here we go! I'm gonna get boxed. Yeah! Oh, I need to be way faster to get a bird. Oh, oh! You get you get on the shy guy, boom, shy dizzle. <laughs> I just made mark. Time to watch, time to watch what the pros do. Where the pillar? He long jumps, of course. That makes so much. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Before I switch back, what does he do after that? Okay, he floats. He goes. And floats. Okay, 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 okay. And the long jump. Perfect. 
<laughs> I was really waiting for that. Here and Boing! I'm jumping too far. <laughs> I love that. I don't know why. Mario dying to the, <laughs> the quicksand just gets me. <laughs> Okay, 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 okay. Here we go! And I think that's... For a lot of them, that's the only two that they get from here. But I got Bomb Clip, so... I don't really technically need to do that one. So I'll call this, uh... Shifty Sand... Shifty Sand Land done in 17 minutes. Cool. 